marvelous day to get to the edge, the edge of your emotions, the edges of creativity, the edges of, inf of, of imagination. The only risk is we might fall over. I'm Jeff Jower. And I'm Rick Levine for Planet Pulse on this Thursday, February 13th. I think um, it, it's been said that only those who go over the edge can write about it with authority. And today is one of those days, it's, it's edgy, it's edgy. I don't know that we have to go over it, but I think we need to get close enough to get the adrenaline going. Right, and courage is a big part of today's story. The moon is in Leo, the sign of the heart. So with the moon in Leo, we're supposed to take risks in terms of expressing our feelings, in terms of coming up with ideas. But what really makes today edgy is not that moon in Leo, it's Leo's key ruling planet, a star actually, the sun, that is the significant player in this adventure story. That's right, and the, the sun, which is in Aquarius, makes a um, half of a square, uh, a semi-square, to Uranus, which is the key planet of Aquarius, and Uranus is like lightning striking. Uranus is, it's fire, but it's not, I mean, it's, it's, it's fiery in as much as it's lightning. It's like electrical, it's sparky. That's a better way of saying it. And the sun's half square to Uranus can release tension and kind of really kind of make the, make the brain cells fire in ways that are very edgy. From which we can get some brilliant ideas. But cooperation might be a little bit difficult because with the sun hooking up in a challenging angle with Uranus, the planet of independence and rebellion, we each want to express our own will independently, which can make cooperation, I think, a bit more difficult. And, and, and double down with the moon in Leo that says, I'm the boss. I'm the boss. I'm, I am the star. What my feelings are, are the center of the universe. All the planets, all the everything else's are all extras in my movie. And so there is a bit of, I think you're right, Jack, Jeff, um, of lack of cooperation or a possible lack of cooperation that can put us even further out on the edge. I think we need to find ways back toward the center, at least work that through in our mind as we move toward the edge. And another way to use the fiery energy of the sun in, uh, of, of the moon in Leo and the sun Uranus is to develop our intuition. Uh. And no coincidence, Rick and I are participants in the Intuition 2 conference in Los Angeles from April 16th through 18th. Go to intuition number two, just the number two conference.com to get the details. But we want to let you know that tomorrow is the last day of the early bird special. If you want to join Rick and me and other teachers here connected to tarot.com to raise your level of intuition, to really live the 21st century, go to intuition two conference.com and sign up now. So if I sign up now, I can save big bucks, huh? He's an intuitive you, guy. I got, that, I got, got that intuitively. You got it.